Right, welcome back to a brand new Goal Anger video and today it is Derby County versus Oxford United. It's a Tuesday night at Pride Park Stadium early on in the season now and we face Oxford United. We faced Oxford United last season at home in the first game of the season. Conor Horahan scoring a brilliant goal late on Sealers, the three points. I'm hoping more of the same today. But Oxford United have strengthened. They've got a better squad than last season. I think the transfer window that they've just had under Liam Manning has been very successful for them. They've brought in some really decent players, so it's going to be a tough match. Derby... In our last game, we had a very nice away win at Burton Albion, a 3-0 victory, very comfortable for us by the final whistle. Oxford United in their last game beat Carlisle United 1-0. Both sides have one loss and one win in the league, and I'm hoping Derby County can register their second win of the season here tonight. But it's going to be a difficult encounter, so what's my score prediction? I'm going to go with a narrow 2-1 victory for the Rams. I think it's going to be a difficult game, a tight game, a few chances but I'm hoping we can come out on top. A player that I'm interested to see play tonight is Ruben Rodriguez from Oxford United. You know, he was signed from Notts County in pre-season. He was linked with us throughout the summer until he moved to Oxford. And I think he's going to be a prolific goal scorer in League One. Hopefully not against Derby today. But without further ado, let's go to Pride Pot Stadium. Nelson gives the ball away, sets Oxford on her attack, ball played out wide and Harris fires it in at Wildsmith's near post, 1-0 Oxford. Oxford score a nice move, but Derby have been really poor tonight. Martin Waggle on the half volley makes it 2 1 with about 10 minutes to go. That was the chance. Well, that is the end of that match. Uh, at least I got the score prediction right, but got it the wrong way, unfortunately. So it has ended Derby County 1, Oxford United 2. Oxford United deserved three points. Uh, they were better than us on the pitch today for the full 90 minutes. Derby... Once again, just like the Wigan game, we just weren't good enough today. The passing was poor from us. We couldn't really string more than two passes together. And when we did get further up the pitch, the final ball wasn't there. I felt like we didn't test the Oxford goalkeeper nearly as enough than what we should have. With the players on the pitch, that probably is our strongest eleven, But it's just not clicking at the moment in the three at the back formation with win-backs. Thought Oxford, they looked good when they moved the ball. They came forward. Obviously, the first goal, Derby, Curtis Nelson gives it away right into the middle. An Oxford break and then a great finish by Mark Harris to Mark Wildsmith's near post. The second goal comes through Mark Harris again. Nice move and he finishes it on the edge of the box into the bottom right corner. 
However, Oxford could have been 2-0 up before that, but Wildsmith pulled off a fantastic save. Derby, obviously Martin Waghorn scored with five minutes to go. A neat finish from him. He's looked lively coming off the bench, but unfortunately Derby have been uh, poor tonight, really. And it's not improved since the Wigan game at home and we're still looking for an elusive point at home after two home fixtures. Obviously, we did win away at Burton Albion, but I felt like that score line has flattered us a little bit. Obviously, Fleetwood Town at home now on Saturday. Am I confident for that one? No, not at all, unfortunately. I'm a little bit nervous heading into that one if we put in a performance like we did today. Then Fleetwood will be taking the points off us. But you've got to be optimistic and hope that we can produce something better on Saturday and try and get our first home win of the season. If you have enjoyed today's video, don't forget to like and subscribe. Follow my social medias down below. And I'll see you in the next one.